All right, we got the three bark, which was surprisingly hard to collect. <laughs> Let's see what you get. It. it looks like the scraps you took from the green men match those from the tournament hall. Why would they steal the spiral cup? When the green men first appeared, groundskeeper Vern studied them a bit. Maybe he can tell you more. All right. Back to our good old friend, groundskeeper Vern. Gotta love the guy, right? I wish I could, like, play this blind all over again. Because I, I love the story of this game. It's great. But it's okay. Let us, uh... Go to the groundskeeper. I don't know much more than you do, but the Earth Magic Instructor, Professor Drawers, is the real expert on the Green Men. He did a lot of work in Tanglewood Way examining them when they first appeared. He ordered the street to be closed. Go speak to him outside his classroom. Drawers should help you get to the bottom of things. It's all starting to come out, Drawers. Just surrender now. What kind of mount is that? Oh my god, Grandmaster too. Shinobi Dragon. Huh. Interesting. Alright, let's talk to Chester. I was afraid you'd discover that the green men were involved. This isn't good at all. What? This is a most distressing turn of events. Still, I have just the thing to deal with the green men and recover the spiral cup. But why were you afraid? Step into my classroom, won't you? And let's see if we can't get you straightened out. He's gonna attack me. That was so suspicious sounding. Oh yeah, I remember this part. Oh jeez. I remember this part. Pretty clearly. I hadn't anticipated you discovering my connection to the green men so soon. You won't leave here to warn the others. <sighs> well, uh, it doesn't matter, because I'm going to scrape you off the floor when I'm done. <laughs> Get some handcuffs or something. All right. Let us... Uh, I don't need that. I uh, don't need Pixie. I just, okay, that's good enough. Should have checked the health that he had just to make sure, but uh, I think I'm fine. Life blade, yeah. Life blade again, yeah. And he passes. Okay, fair enough. Okay, I guess. Okay, he actually does not have that much health. I'm surprised. Actually, only has 845. It's actually not that bad. Leprechaun. Yep. <laughs> I'm about to call all their spell use. And double pass. Yeah, okay. Pretty basic. Whoa. Ah, uh, no. I was actually just about to use a trap, but, you know, okay. I didn't realize he had cheats. Maybe because it never mattered before, because he was so easy. And the first time I ever did Wisteria, I was like, well over level 60, so... Because I'm pretty sure this came out after... I actually can't remember when this thing came out, so... Ooh, I don't know. I still have to wait another turn, unfortunately, and I'm probably going to get hit pretty hard this turn by the tree ant. Considering he hasn't cast a single spell. Loves using Leprechaun. Alright, let's see what he uses. Treant. Makes sense, I guess. Treant using Treant. Ow. Give me a power pit, man. Of course not. Uh, Alright, Meteor Strike it is. I will take out Chester. I'm not sure about the minions, though. We'll have to see. Nope, doesn't quite. Doesn't quite take him out. Which kind of sucks, honestly, but... 
you know, it is what it is, I suppose. Not much else I can do right now. Okay. You know, another leprechaun. Wow. They're really into leprechaun. Jeez. Oh my god. This has to work though, or else I'm screwed. Okay. The power pip is the only reason I did that. Now I only have one guy to deal with. And cast another leprechaun. Why am I surprised? Why am I not? I'm not even surprised, actually. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, cool. I actually just have a spark. That works. Don't even need to heal and save up for another hit. Alright. Fair enough. Take that just as well. Now that I have been defeated, I can think for myself. Let me get out of this place. Speak to me in the street. Very well. So wait, his mind was being controlled or something? I didn't remember that part, but then again, that all comes back when as you play, so. Alright. I've never been so thankful for a drubbing, let me tell you. <laughs> okay. The magical defeat you inflicted has broken the enthrallment Lord Bramble has over me for a while. I will tell you what I can before his spell reasserts itself. Lord Bramble is the culprit, the one behind the theft. Lord Bramble wants to reclaim all of Wisteria to the wild, overgrown state it was before Pigswick Academy was founded. Okay. He wants to discredit Pigswick and to pit Ravenwood against it. That is why he chose to have me frame you for the theft. You must go to Tanglewood Way and defeat Lord Bramble in his tower. He has my soul trapped in a wooden doll. Bring it to me. It may be that he still has the spiral cup in his keeping. If it has not been smashed to bits, it will be in Bramble's tower. All right. Very well then. I suppose I gotta go do this and then we can finish off the tournament. Because we only have one more round left. So. Let us uh, do that. Didn't want to go into the battle. I just wanted the health spark. Uh, I do need more health. So. This kind of sucks. I don't want to have to use a potion. So. Actually I'm going to go this way. So, uh, more health sparks here. A bunch of them, actually. Which is good. I also going to get the wallflower while I'm here. Uh, which is somewhere... There it is. For the higher up places, I don't know exactly where they're located. But, like, I know, like, around where it is. So, like... Yeah. All right. Let us defeat Lord Bramble. Let's go. I knew that Draws was weak and would fail me, but I did not expect him to fall to a mere child. Come and face your doom. Okay, but uh, what is being a child? I'm not even a child, first of all. But what does that even have to do with anything? It's literally irrelevant. You're just mad. Like you lost your spell over him or whatever the hell you had over him. So, stop being a crybaby. <laughs> he looks pretty scurry though, I'll give him that. Life blade. Life blade. So predictable, holy crap. <laughs> it's like not even a contest at all. It's just... Very easy. Okay. Um, I don't really want to get rid of anything. I, I guess I'll get rid of Fane. I guess. No, I don't want to do that. I want to get rid of... Uh, shoot, 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 shoot. I'll get rid of one Elemental Blade and then I'll use the other one. I don't know. Because I'm trying to find room to get Fire Blade out. But uh, I have to... Uh, 
keep certain spells in because I know they're gonna live through the first hit, so. How? You're gonna cast Leprechaun too, I assume? No, actually. Something different that I didn't expect. Okay. That's cool. Uh, okay. This is actually good. More pips for me. Death shield? Yeah. Oh, Sunbird. Interesting. That I was not expecting. That's interesting. Okay. Uh, yeah, now I'll hit. Won't kill, obviously, but, you know, it'll do some... Uh, never mind, I fizzled. Ugh. And there's a weakness. Okay. Very well. Guess I am, uh, sparking. The green men, obviously. Had to do it. Alright, let us meteor strike. It was about time. I was due for a fizzle, I guess. Okay. Nice. It's gonna hurt a bit. Ow. Very well. How much health do you have left? Oh. Pfft. Bro, let's use Kraken. Waiting for the chance to use it again. Amulets are so underrated. Like, look how much damage that does, man. Just for four pips. It's crazy. Lord Bramble drops a small wooden doll. The one Professor Drawer spoke of. And there it is. The Spiral Cup. Okay. Yeah, let's get the Pigswick papers. To spread the word of Pigswick's educational innovations, Headmaster Pigswick started a magical tournament. Students representing all of the different schools of magic from across the Spiral were invited to compete. The Spiral Cup was selected as the grand prize, a fitting symbol of magic supremacy and skill. Though in the past, it has been won by Ravenwood and Mushu schools, for many years the cup has been claimed by Pigswick. Coincidentally, the years Pigswick won the Spiral Cup were also years in which no other schools appeared to compete. <laughs> well, it makes sense now. It makes a lot more sense now hearing that. I, lo I love the uh, history books and stuff. They're really cool. Last two are in the library archives, which I'll I'll get off camera. It's it's whatever, you guys. It's a side world. You don't really need. Oh, why am I in here? I gotta go to Chester drawers. I just remembered that. Bramble on. Like I'll see if I can go into the library archives. But uh, I don't think I can, so... You have defeated Lord Bramble and put a stop to his madness. And with that wooden doll, my soul is now mine again. Go tell Headmistress Crisp that the Spiral Cup is recovered, and the dastardly plot is at an end. Yeah. And she's gonna say... And by the way, you couldn't have done it without me because I actually know real magic unlike all the students in your school. What? Who? I didn't know Mushu had a school for magic. It's interesting. Well, well, well. You have been busy. I'm relieved to put the matter of the missing spiral cup behind us, and I apologize for our suspicions. Could you be so kind as to return the cup to the tournament hall and to speak to Master Glenn Deming about your final match? Sure. Against uh the crybaby or gonna be the crybaby Randolph. I assume he's gonna take his loss pretty hard. And hey, I have 1800 health. That's cool. And what level am I? I actually don't know. I think level 37. Yeah, because I didn't get a Dahlia thing here, so. We're starting Mushu actually pretty dang. Uh, you return the Spyro Cup to its proper place. High level. Pretty high level for starting. 
uh, Mushu. If I do Mushu next, I might do Grizzleheim. I thank you for restoring the Spiral Cup to its rightful place. Though you have proved a worthy duelist, I feel it will stay here. Mm. The student you face for your final round of the tournament is none other than Randolph Spellshine. Randolph is my greatest pupil, the finest student I have ever taught in all of my years at Pigsvik Academy. Still, you must at least attempt the formality of the duel. Go to the Hall of the Gorgon to face your defeat. <laughs> Yeah, okay, buddy. <laughs> Your student isn't that good. He's a cheater, too, so you should kind of be ashamed. This is what you really should be. Alright. Randolph. He's myth, too, man. I didn't think you'd show up. Well, you've had a good run, but this is where you meet your better. Yeah, I'm sure about that. Uh, take me your strike out. We'll go with uh, Phoenix. And sorry about the noise. Probably only hear it faintly, but it's still there. So yeah. I can't remember what I can or can't do. So, because I'm pretty sure he cheats, but I'm not entirely sure how. So, we'll see. Well, honestly, if I just wait for Kraken, it more than likely kill, so. Well, there's the cheat. What is it? Pierce? Just takes off shields? <laughs> well, not that I need it anyways, but, you know, it's fine. Uh, should I just wait for Kraken? It might be better, you know, I'll put on more blades, but like, it might be better just to wait for Kraken, honestly. It'd kill him automatically, really. Alright, we got a troll. And yeah, I have a weakness on, but the boost plus the fame plus the blade, Kraken would easily kill. So let's see. Well, let's see what happens. Okay. Let's see. All right. Let's see what happens. Let's use Kraken. It's about time it fizzles, though. So maybe it will. No. Oh, okay. Never mind. How's it feel losing there, bud? I know when I'm beaten, though I can barely believe it. You're a better wizard than I am, by far. Go and tell Master Glenn Deming that you've defeated the best that Pigswick Academy has to offer. Nice. Got her victory over Randolph, unsurprisingly. Yeah, I'm not surprised at all. Nalia was easily harder. Same with Kisai. They would have easily won versus Randolph as well if they got there too. Uh, okay. Unbelievable. This hall will be the emptier for the lack of the cup that has adorned it for so long. Go and tell Headmistress Crisp that Pigswick's record is broken and that Ravenwood is the winner now. I don't know why you're surprised at that. Pigswick was the only competing school for the past couple of years, which is the only reason you've had the Spile Cup. Like, your wizards are garbage. Just as simple as that. How does that feel? Really good. I can't say I'm pleased to see the Spiral Cup leaving our care. But it truly went to the best wizard in the tournament. Return to Wizard City and tell Headmaster Ambrose of your victory. But remind him that next year, we will take the cup back. I highly doubt that. Your school really is not that good. But, you know. 
I'm sure uh, Ambrose will be happy. Let us... We are the champions, my friends. That's a good quest title. Because we are the champions. Quite literally. Alright. Forgot how calm the Wizard City music is. Alright. Let's go to Ambrose. Let's see what's up. Whoa. How was your term abroad? It was fun. For the most part. Interesting. Oh, you've done your school proud. You showed them what true wizards are made of. Extra credit for you. Yeah, love me some extra credit. Alright, but uh, that's going to do it for this video. We got A plus student, badge earned. If you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the subscribe button down below. Next time we're going to either start Mushu or uh, Grizzleheim, so we can decide then. But that being said, I'll see you guys all in the next video of the Rizal Walkthrough, and peace out. Bye-bye.